Hello friends, Suzanne Hug here coming to your home from mine. I'm a Mesa, Arizona business owner, mom of two, and a community leader. I'm running to become one of Mesa's representatives this year in November for Legislative District 25, and I'm asking for your vote. I've thought a lot about voting and the consequences of elections during my lifetime. I registered to vote when I turned 18 and headed to my local caucus meeting with my mom. Before I even cast my first ballot, I was elected as a neighborhood representative. Here in Arizona, those neighborhood representatives are known as precinct committeemen. It's a position that I now hold for the Crocus Precinct here in East Mesa, and I take my role seriously. I've had the opportunity to knock on my neighbor's doors invite them over, and talk about their hopes and their concerns. I know we're all concerned right now and, and that's putting it mildly. There is a pandemic sweeping our nation and exposing every ugly crack in our safety nets. Healthcare, education, communication, and especially leadership. In my previous job as a marketing manager at an insurance company, one of my duties was to write the disaster plan for my area. I spent out countless hours reviewing scenarios, assessing capabilities, and coming up with a comprehensive and practical plan to protect people and to keep business going. In that order, People always, always come before profits in my book, and they always will. You know, I'm disappointed that leaders who have been in office for term after term weren't more prepared. Worse, they seem to actually lack the basic skills to handle events like these. I do want to take a moment to applaud Phoenix Mayor Kate Gallego. She took quick and decisive action. If Governor Ducey had followed her lead more quickly, I'm sure many Arizonans' lives would have been saved. I'm still hoping that we don't have a lot of losses, but in times like these, we need more than hope. Today, I'm asking you to share this message with at least three friends. Tell them that there are good leaders who care about people and that we're going to get through this together, that we'll be able to pick up the pieces and to build our own vision of the future. And I wanna say thank you. I have seen so many acts of kindness during these dark times that I know that we are going to come back. We just can't afford to do it with the same old leadership, going back to the same old ways. Our world is fundamentally changing and we need to acknowledge that and then build that new vision. I'm asking for you to help me be one of those new leaders as we find this new way forward. So take care of yourself and your loved ones, and I wish you all the best. I'm going to be putting out a video every Monday to stay in touch, to answer questions, and to let you get to know me. I think it's a really important piece of voting that somebody be more than just a name on the ballot. So I want you to get to know me, a little bit about my experience, my skills, who I am, and what I will stand for. My name is Suzanne Hug, and I'm your LD25 candidate for House of Representatives this coming November. Thank you so much. Take care.